Hey guys, so this review is just strictly footage only, only specifically for dirt bike and OHV riders looking to compare the footage between the two. First of all, I did use the same SD card on both of the cameras and made sure stabilization was on. My personal opinion is, for the price, it is not a good camera. See, there is actually better quality action cameras like the Akaso for the same price, if not even less. Just check out this footage of the uh, console camera that I ended up buying and you can see for less of a price, this camera is much better. But yeah, that's the Akaso camera, and honestly, here's the Vantop camera. Okay, right now it's uh, 2K. This is what I normally record my GoPro at. Yeah, it's got a whole lot rockier too. Man, this thing is, it's really distracting. <laughs> so moderate, it makes you just wanna always look down at it. It's, I guess it's something you need to get used to. Again, this is just only video. Uh, you know, I'm not really. This is the dirt bike edition. Not really the. Uh, you know, really get into it. This is more like set it up, record. It's uh. Okay, now it's 4K, 24 frames per second. That's the only option it comes with. In the 4K. This one seems a little smoother. So, let's get down here for a bit. Alright, right now this is 1080p. So in order to make it fit, in, fit into a helmet cam, it comes like a little piece of device and you have to like bring it up right now. It's like, uh, I guess it's good and bad. Good because you kind of, uh, you kind of see if it's recording or not. Because it kind of like sticks out a bit. Wow, they closed down uh, that trail. That used to be open. All right, but anyways, this just is this is just a video to compare the GoPro Hero 7 Black versus the uh, Vantop camera. So hopefully you guys enjoy the footage. Again, this is just strictly footage only. I'm not really getting into the specifics, the techs, uh, the tech part of the cameras or anything like that. Anyhow, this is going to be the GoPro Hero 7 uh, Black edition. So here's the footage. It's the gnarly sections of the trail. Whew. It's about the only place we have to ride in Colorado when it starts snowing but whew. Uh -oh. 